But the question that this crowd brings to mind is not how many of us would go along with Jesus to watch him perform miracles, but how many of us are willing to follow him down off the mountain and into tangible ministry? How many are willing to go down into the valleys, into the low places, into dark areas of the faith that Jesus will often call his disciples to go? You know, in the Gospels, the more Jesus called people to follow after him and the deeper he called them into discipleship, the fewer who were actually willing to keep following him. In John 6, when Jesus was teaching a multitude of his followers the fact that he was the bread of life, when he said that they should eat of his body and drink of his blood, an analogy alluding to the need of a person's full faith and reliance on his work on the cross for their salvation, when he taught them that, many turned away from him, and the text says that they actually deserted him.